little video of how we calibrate the auto layout for a measuring mode. Uh, I have a 300 foot tape measure taped down to the asphalt. I have a marked out, taped at the one foot mark with the tape less than one foot. Come straight out to the other end. I have it taped at the 26 foot mark with the tape on closer to 27. That gives me a clear 25 foot space between this, the edge of each tape. On the machine I have in the back holder, my twin laser setups with the green dot laser on it. We're going to start up the machine, which I probably should have done before. calibrate settings mode to calibration let me find out why it's running so lousy wow huh. oh you know why i turned the gas off on this one hold on ah much better when it has gas to run all right, so we're gonna change our menu back to the calibration mode. We have it set for 25 foot. We've got our laser down. We'll try doing this on a line driver. Quiet that down a little bit. So I'm gonna do a test run first to make sure I'm straight. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the laser right on the edge of the tape. Right there. Then we'll straighten the machine and we'll go down to this side. Make sure I can fit. And I'll hit my door. And we fit just in time. Alright. So then I'll go back to the beginning. To my 26 foot mark. Get my machine nice and straight here. Now you can tell the, how the different, when it hits the green, green hits the silver, it lights up. That's why I use duct tape to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to line it up so it's just in front of the duct tape by fractions. I'm going to hit my button to start it. You can see it's spinning, the dial spinning. Then I'll take that down, right down the edge of my tape measure. to my other piece of tape. Keep rolling up, rolling up. Once it hits it, the highlight on it, right there, hit the button. That's it, that's how you calibrate the machine. So we are good to go. I had to calibrate it today because it turned out somehow one of my tires had 15 PSI, the other one had 45 PSI, so. Auto layout does not like that much uh, discrepancy between tire pressure, so we had to do that. So now I can take everything up, take these lasers off, put them away. If anybody's interested, let's see if there's a name on the lasers. Uh, no, there's only no, no name on the lasers. Oh, there it is. Laser point lasers. Not bad, I've used them a bunch of time. I use them for this. I have the regular dots, the built-in dot lasers. I have two of them on the front of my machine for doing, uh, use them with the auto layout. But I use these when I use, when I have to do something that those don't work out for. Nice to have battery ones as backups. Thanks for watching.